All right, hey guys, here we are. Hole number seven. Hole number six, sorry. And what I've been doing is maybe right around four on the top spin, more or less. And what I'm going to try to do is try to play this wind effect first. So you can see that I'm kind of aiming my bullseye right at the edge here. However, I'm playing the wind off the right edge of the bullseye, and I'm just assuming that it's going to land right around where the target is. Additionally to this aim, I'm going to go maybe about eight rings, somewhere right in here. And we're just going to go full throttle. And sure enough, there you can see it lands very centered in the fairway. And we get it shooting up towards the bunker here, but it should stop before the uh, before the bunker. Keep in mind that's the lowest possible wind that we could have. So with that amount of spin, it should never be able to roll through into the far into the farther. But you can see that it ends up landing right around kind of where I put that bullseye. And additionally to that spot, I only need to go eight rings on top, which is in total it's a 13 ring adjustment. However, the reason that I'm going eight is because I'm playing off the right of the bullseye instead of the target. So I'm not playing that wind, essentially. If you're looking at, you know, I'm, I'm playing the wind ahead of time in my mind. So, um, you know, keep that in mind. Uh, this should lead to a very consistent results um, when you're able to pull that off and should make this hole much easier. You'll see that we'll be able to get down we aren't going to be much more than mid-club here on this adjustment. So it won't be too bad here. So you'll see, we're just kind of right in the middle here. What I've been liking is maybe right around four and a half on the spin. And just try to put that guide maybe a little bit through the hole, kind of like this. And you'll see that I'm just trying to essentially play roundabout because I know that the ball effect or the wind effect is going to push this ball now in this case i'm thinking maybe six uh 8.6 8.7 rings just kind of like in between mid and max on the adjustment because i am pulling up towards the max so let's just see how this comes in looks pretty good but it looks like it's just to the right so just keep that wind effect trick in mind you know you gotta play it through the hole and to the right because the wind effect is going to take it but you can see it's a very good opportunity for you to get it so hopefully you're able to hold that one good luck and i'll see you guys on the next one